welcome back guys again in this tutorial today i will show you one of the most important uses of prespice or this type of software that is you can hear i think that is transient state of a circuit and that is called in prespice transient analysis what is transient immediately after closing a switch in any circuit behavior of physical quantity with respect to time is called transient state and it is before the equilibrium in equilibrium after in equilibrium or after equilibrium it is called steady state and with before this we call transient state of the circuit so, so we want to know the transient analysis transient behavior of current and voltage in any circuit in this tutorial so first of all we have to come to our page new project and you have to draw this circuit i think you draw it very easily this resistance resistance change this value 10 k not 10 and this is tail 10 milli henry mh you can see 10 VDC voltage source and so we have to we have to analyze the transient analysis of this circuit so that is at from at time t is equal to 0 to that t is equal to our required point we can get the circuit circuit output now you can see what is the first of all you have to show rl and then rc first of all you, you can see rl here you can see this is this type of graph will come this is called steady state value that is i i max i max with respect to time is this is this graph you can see this is i max and this is voltage graph this is voltage across inductance and this is current in the circuit you can see i is equal to v by r 1 minus e r t by l and voltage is this you can see a graph means at time t is equal when t is equal to 0 this is v by r means at this point so in that way this, this type of curve will will have to come now it, what is tau tau is the called the time constant of the circuit means when when i'm this is the voltage graph so when the current attained max 63 percent of i max at the time that time is called time constant and the voltage decay is 30 seven percent of vl that time is called l by r this this graph is going to infinity and uh, you can see t is equal to infinity v by r but in ideal case but in practical this is going to some up five time constant this value is equal to i max now you can this is theory part you can also i think uh, get from books or in internet you, you have to study some theory parts because this is the software part i will show you but i will explain you something we going to anal analyze tangent condition of this rl circuit so first of all you have to know the what is the time constant of this circuit rl circuit so the time constant of the rl circuit is you you can see in theory and in figure before that time constant of this is l y r means this the value that is you can say l by r this is the time constant of this circuit what is here you can l 10 milli 10 milli by 10 10 10 into 10 power minus 3 
so you can see 0 0.001 and we have to going our final point to what is the final point of analysis 5 time tau means time constant that is 0 0.005 so this why we calculate this you can see now our circuit is complete save here and here go to piece spice new simulation profile and type anything you know all this and then then you can see a pop up window here time domain tangent still automatically is set in analysis type and this is the run time De and here you can what you have to write time constant 5 time 5 tau means you have to run 2 up time 5, five time constant this is the last point of analysis in your graph five times this so double zero five it is calculated value yeah and don't forget to skip the initial tangent bus point calculation skip this this means you have saying piece by that our inductor or if capacitor doesn't charge doesn't charge before going before coming in this circuit means initially zero voltage zero charge so apply ok now here one new thing if you here run piece spice you can your circuit is running here come your output here this is time graph already but here you want to add graph so place the this voltage level marker and current level marker first of all you have to current you want to mark this anywhere in the circuit this is marker this is series circuit series in series so current will be same either you connect here or anywhere so now you you can see a graph so can you see a graph our graph is matching here you can see 5 tau 5 millisecond and this is 1 ampere equal to so this type i r1 and now we have to voltage we want to know voltage so what is voltage simply simply remove this or you you can't remove this also simply voltage across inductance and you can see in the here you can fall reverse of this at time t is equal to 0 that's it 10 volt from our formula you can see so this is the RL circuit analysis similarly you can do for RC circuit also so replace C by inductance remove this inductance and set capacitance so do it you can see we place capacitor here 10 microfarad capacitor and what is the time constant of this capacitor capacitor RC circuit time constant of RC circuit formula is simply RC nothing simply RC RC and what is this that is equal to you can see R10 
and this is 10 micro means 10 to power 10 into 10 to power minus 6 so what is the it, if you we into this G I think this and we going to 5 time constant so simply into into 5 so we have final time this to set now you no need to add another new simulation profile simply edit simulation profile and you can change this only add one zero also apply and ok simply current marker here and you can see run this the current graph with respect to time so here you can see reverse of inductance circuit that is the current is falling and we can see voltage is going to upward so we want to now we want to voltage across capacitor so simply voltage marker place on that and go to our here you can see simply this is a magic you can put marker and your graph is modified you can see so thank you guys this is the RL and RC circuit tangent condition conditions analysis so we come with next video Thank you guys keep watching and if you have any doubt any problem comment below I will solve your problem but don't forget to subscribe this channel because this channel will come with a very very useful video in future so thank you guys.